What's up guys, welcome back to More J Stew. Today's vlog is gonna be pretty fun. Hope everyone is doing fantastic by the way. So I have some stuff that I've been shooting, just haven't uploaded it yet. So that's what today's vlog is gonna be about. A couple weeks ago, Mary and I went and did our first 3D ultrasound. I thought ultrasounds were cool just to begin with, but 3D ultrasounds, that was like next level of cool. And it was actually kinda, it's kinda creepy as well. <laughs> Not gonna lie. I filmed a little bit while we were there, just like in the room. The room's pretty cool, cause you go in, there's this big TV screen, cause it's more like a, uh, I don't know, like a party. You invite people and everyone can watch. So there's a big TV screen, a big couch, everyone can sit on. It's pretty chill. So I filmed a little bit. Take a look at this. We're getting ready to do the 3D ultrasound, which is gonna be insane. Are you ready? We're just gonna get started with baby's heartbeat. Wow. I got my own personal TV and then they all got this huge one. <laughs> Whoa. He's right in the placenta today. Hello. Hello. Do you know you're having? <laughs> Boy. He's got his face right against the placenta. He's kind of smushed. He's got a little arm up. Is that just kind of boy? see a part of his nose and his arm. Oh, that's cool. So hopefully we can get him to turn his head a little. Yeah, he's just <laughs> see his hand. Go to that left side again. Okay. There we go again. Oh. Yeah, baby's awake. Oh, that is weird. Yeah, you guys were doing earlier woke me up. I know. That baby said, What? That's so cute. Oh, baby. Yeah, he's holding on to his foot over there. <laughs> he's doing some stretches. He's getting ready for the ultimate kicks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thumbs up for rock and roll. Thumbs up, everybody! All right. For rock and roll! <laughs> and we have the thumbnail. <laughs> good job. Thanks. She did a yeah, good job, all huh? Done. You're crying up there. Oh, the baby's, oh, the baby's crying. crying. Not I'm, like, I'm not crying. <laughs> Pretty happy. <laughs> this is the video set to music, and then oh, oh, thank you. What do you want to say? Yeah. Say something yeah. funny. Yeah. <laughs> so I thought it was pretty cool that you can see the baby open its eyes during the ultrasound. I was like, What's going on? This is way too weird. I guess you could say this is the first time we've ever kind of met our son. <laughs> Mary is due December 26th. It could be on the 26th, could be maybe the 25th on Christmas, before, after, I really don't know. When you guys were babies, were you on your due date? Were you before or were you late? And if you don't know, this could be a good time to go ask your parents like, hey, so what's the story here? Was I due when I was due? And if you want, you can leave your comments down below. I'd love to read some of your stories, but I think it's kind of cool. It's a nice little conversation you can have with your parents. There's probably something fun maybe you don't know about. Also, another thing we've done recently, Mary, myself, and my dad, we went back to Ohio to visit my grandma. So I haven't been back to visit grandma since last year, maybe. So it was time for a visit. We were just there for like a couple days, just a long weekend, but it was, it was nice to visit grandma. She's not able to get around as well as she used to. We took her out to do some activities. One thing we did was the pumpkin festival, which was pretty sweet. Ohio has this really big pumpkin festival and they've been doing it for a hundred years, something like that. And like the main point of this festival is they try to grow the biggest pumpkins they can. And this year, the winner, their pumpkin weighed 1,700 pounds. So for comparison, the average car weighs like 4,000 pounds. So this pumpkin, a pumpkin, weighed almost half as much as a car. So check this out. The best ride at the pumpkin show. 
Hang on. Bye. <laughs> 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 There's so much pumpkin stuff everywhere. I'm trying to decide what to get for lunch, and I found pumpkin pulled pork. So I'm gonna try that. Did you see something you wanted? Uh, not yet. <laughs> Don't worry, there's plenty of options. Mm. And then had what was that? Pumpkin chili dog type thing. <laughs> pumpkin and chili dog. They're made with locally grown pumpkins. Okay. Pretty good. Yeah. Amish donuts. Mm. <laughs> hey, buddy. Shaved all around. We're at a farm picking out some pumpkins. So these ones looks like they already picked out. They're green. Oh, yeah, but you can go out in the field and just pick them. So. And try and find a huge one, what? right? No, and you have to carry it. No, <laughs> <laughs> so we got some little ones up there, and then some giant boys over here. I want to see them. There it is the big pumpkin. I don't know, you're not supposed to pick it up. That's... Ah, I want to try. And it's probably 200 plus pounds. That's why I want to try and pick it up. <laughs> There's some huge pumpkins. Your foot's big, though. You have big feet. All right, where's yeah, your you. foot? There. We found a cool friend. I'm assuming he's poisonous. That's a good assumption. Oh, he's so cool. There's a bunch of bees behind you, by the way. Bees, run. This farm also has a really big corn maze. I don't know if we're gonna check that out, but man, I was just telling Mary, it'd be really fun to own a farm. No. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Who would take care of it? Not you. Well, I'd, Not hire, I'd hire some people, right? We got some cows, some pigs, some no, chickens. No. <laughs> Big Jimmy here. The pumpkin pooped on me, <laughs> so I'm not getting this one. So those were a couple things going on in my life recently that I wanted to share with y'all. So what we're trying to do is all of our like Christmas shopping, Christmas decorating, all that stuff. We're trying to do it as soon as possible, as early as possible. So over this past weekend, we actually decorated our house with Christmas stuff. Let me show you. We got the new mantle decoration going. Put up this stuff on top of the cabinets. Pretty cool. Ah, Kev! This is my fave. So we put up the Christmas trees. We made this centerpiece, which turned out awesome. It smells really good. Ah. We're already in the Christmas spirit. It's coming early this year, so. A lot of people have been asking us if we have any names picked out for the baby, and the answer is not really. We have we have one name that we kind of like, but other than that, we're so blank on names. Justin and I were talking, it'd be funny if, uh, we wouldn't do this for the actual name, this would just be for like a vlog for being funny. But if we took a bunch of names, either you guys can write us names, we'll just write a bunch of names, some names that don't even make sense, Put them in a bowl and then we'll draw them out and see like what our kids names will be <laughs> that's the end of the vlog today i hope you guys enjoyed it two things this friday for fort friday is a new 24 hour video that we just filmed and man oh man it was insane so be sure to come back for that get excited for fort friday and then second hypothetically speaking if uh if we got new t-shirts and merch available to buy in the next couple weeks, would you be interested in that?
Don't forget, y'all need to laugh daily, and we'll see you in the next vlog. Peace out. Nice.